Hey, YouTube's James from Mr. and Mrs. So we kept chipping away at it and we got the deck pretty much almost cleaned off. That outdoor fireplace and this outdoor, I guess it's like a fireplace, it's going to go in the shed. The gazing bowl is going to go in there. And then we're down just to uh, not much left. This is the rug I pressure washed yesterday. Got that all cleaned up. Just waiting for it to 100% dry before we roll her up and store it on the front porch. And then we get over here. That white table served it for this year, but should have did a little bit more prep work to it. To uh, You can see how the rain did penetrate it. I thought we had enough paint on there and everything else, and it wasn't going to do it, but it did. So that's going to go in the, in the old dumpster. And then uh, I think that's going to be the location for the smoker. I always wanted to build with some side tables for the uh, Blackstone. And then on this side, I'm going to might do like a wood storage rack for uh, for that smoker. But that's something I'm still trying to plan out and figure out how I'm going to do it to not make it look ridiculous after the missus did all this work on the deck. So we'll get to that. Then I still got to do some shrub trimming, the final cleaning of the uh, grill, even though we use it all winter. But I got some stuff on there from yesterday when I was cooking. A little bit over there, not much. And then cut those bushes back over there a little bit. Get everything all cleaned up. These outdoor curtains that you saw us do, those will come down. We'll run them through the washer. Probably the dryer, too. I'm thinking. I'm not 100% sure. And then get that uh, all stored up for next year. And the table's going to be the last thing to go. Right now, we just got a bunch of stuff sitting on there. But we're getting everything all cleaned up and getting ready for the, uh, you know, Pennsylvania winter. The TV will come out of the box the box is going to stay obviously there because i'm not going to detach it from the house that thing is on there so i'll pull the tv and then get the thing all closed up for the winter just to make sure nothing happens to the tv that was a gift from the missus and or the missus and the kids so we're going to make sure that thing is able to be used again next year a strawberry plant put out its last little strawberry there the roses in the garden I mean, the cherry tomatoes are still kicking them. They're everywhere on there. So hopefully I'll get a couple more of that. The roses got, it's hard to see, but they got a couple more buds on them. There's another one on this one. This one I probably can get you a better view. See it right there? It's good. Back there, there's three. And then uh, we'll get this all cleaned up. I mean, we're still shooting out flowers. That is for sure. Mrs. did an amazing job this year with the uh, the garden. She wanted a flower garden, and here we are. So, as everything starts dying, we'll pull it and rototill it and get it all ready for next year. Probably throw a bunch of leaves in there and let them... Actually, they're doing that by themselves. <laughs> we'll get it all cleaned up. And then... Uh, See what our plan is for next year for here. But we got big plans going on in the backyard. That's for a later video. So it's gonna be a it's gonna be a good rest of the fall and a lot of projects going on in the spring. Plus whatever we can get done during the winter, because we don't waste any time here. So please like, comment, subscribe, and I'll see you on the next video.